the results are really encouraging. Uh, we found 34% more cancers with 3D mammography or tomosynthesis compared to regular mammography, uh, which is a huge difference, of course. In tomosynthesis, the, the X-ray tube moves in an arc over the breast and acquires a number of low-dose projection images. And then this information is reconstructed by computer to very thin slices of the breast that the radiologist can view on the screen. Uh, and it means that um, we can more easily see where a tumor is in the breast. We used reduced compression during the tomosynthesis, uh, which means that a lot of women uh, liked this method better because it was less painful. Uh, and hopefully, if tomosynthesis will be used as a screening method in the future, it could encourage more women to attend screening. We did not only find more cancers, because with a more sensitive method, you also see a lot of other structures better in the breast. Since we didn't have any comparisons from before, uh, we had to call back those women for further examination to exclude that they actually had a cancer. Uh, so we, the callback rate increased. In the majority of cases, uh, the cancers detected with tomosynthesis, they were invasive cancers. And this means that it is cancers that has the ability to spread outside the breast. And this is an important aspect because we want to find the relevant cancers uh, in a screening program.